Hello my viewers and welcome back to another unboxing, viewing and testing and today I have this EasyMax compact sewing machine space saving and ideal for minor bits of needlework like shortening trouser legs or hemming curtains with two speed levels can be operated either using batteries or power adapter with integrated light to provide ideal view of intercut seams it weighs about 2.2 kilos 12 stitch types with a foot pedal just like a large sewing machine. Well, let's open to see what we have inside and find out more about this product and how we can use it. I think this is my first time. Well, let's see how it goes. We have this lovely large bag. Nice, I like it. You can have your sewing machine inside. And of course included and the manual if you want to read it is your choice but stay with me i'm gonna find out all about this product and there it is small and compact Now at the box we have the power adapter, it is 6 volt 1.2 amp, 7.2 watt power consumption. And with a cable length it is about 2 meters, very nice. The foot pedal to make it easy to switch on and off. And the cable is about 2 meters, the connection, rubber feet at the bottom nice <laughs> one spare needle one threader two thread spools and two lower thread bobbins with thread black and white color perfect and the sewing machine now at the sewing machine we can see the 12 stitch types we can choose with a stitch adjusting wheel one of the 12 by just rotating here we have the hand wheel you can adjust the needle here we can see up and down the reverse button we have the off, on off switch and speed adjustment when sewing without the foot control. Off, low and high. At the bottom we have the battery compartment. You need four 2A batteries. I will use it with a power adapter. Four rubber feet prevent any movement when it's working here it is the bobbin compartment pre-install it another one total we have three with this plastic cover the needle plate with transporter the screw here at the preset foot unit the thread guide here this is the fifth thread guide, we have five total. Inside here we have the second thread guide. This is the third thread guide with the articulated thread pickup with thread guide three. We can see as am I moving this hand wheel, it appears. Here we have the upper thread tension regulator from 1 to 9 it is the maximum it is very important to regulate correct uh, the thread tension at this side we have the thread separator the needle obviously here it is the lever for releasing the preset foot and of course here we have um, the on-off switch for the light, this button. 
DC 3 volt it says. And the light it is down here. Now at the back we have the winder here, the carrying handle, the first thread guide from here, the preset foot lever raises and lowers the preset foot. There it is. With a needle. And of course here we have uh, the socket for connecting the power adapter. And for connecting and the pedal, foot pedal. And here at the back we have in this drawer for your needles, your threads, everything. You can have it inside. You're not going to lose your accessories. Nice, I like it. Well, that was all the levers and the switches that it has this uh, sewing machine. Let's plug it in and see how it works. Okay. <laughs> This is in lower. And off. Releasing. That was my first stitch. And it was uh, the seven. That. Okay, now I will use the petal. And let's adjust it at the five stitch tie. Perfect. Pedal at the feet. I have this t-shirt. And let's start. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Now let's change different type of stitch. Okay, I will use the nine. Let's change again the stitch type. And I will use the 12. Cut the thread. And here we can see the three different type of stitches. First is that. Second, this is in the middle. And the last, we can see here. Wow, I like it. <laughs> I think I will start using this machine more often. Now I will try all the 12 stitches, starting from the first. I have my test t-shirt.
second. Third. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Ten. Eleven. And the last twelve. And here it is, all the stitches. We have some mistakes. Don't judge me too much. It is my first time. I'm sure with uh, the correct adjustments at the sewing machine, we will have a better result. But I like it. I think it's doing a great job. Now, I would like to try a different type of fabric. This is thicker. Adjusting the tension to seven. I will choose the five stitch. And of course here you can cut the thread. Nice results, I like it. Even here, at this point it is thicker. Good job! 
as am I using more the sewing machine I'm learning. <laughs> now let's choose six. Wow, <laughs> nice results. Let's use now the eight. And again, I like it. Good result. Compare it with the T-shirt. I think this fabric has done a better job. T-shirt, it is thinner than this fabric. I think that's why we've got some problems, some mistakes in the process of sewing. But it's okay. I think the result is very acceptable. Now, I will use the lower and high speed from the switch and not from the pedal and on five starting with a low and then high low high and low and off. <laughs> nice, I like it. Good result. This plastic needs to be more secure. Mm. Now I would like to try and add this fabric. It is thicker. Don't stitch at this area. It is too thick. We can see in the threads. It may bend the needle. I only will try at this area. And on four, yep, correct. And of course you can use in the white. There it is. If you wish. With a petal again. Nice, I like it, good job. And let's try and the reverse. There is the reverse here, this button, this lever. Oh yes, it's working without a problem. Reverse and again. Reverse again. Nice. <laughs> and again, this plastic goes away. <laughs> and here it is in the result. Now we know this uh, sewing machine is working with uh, the power adapter. You can use it and with batteries, unplug the power adapter. And here, it is the compartment for the batteries and we need four 2A batteries very tight just to see how it's performing with the batteries let's use again my test fabric and you can use obviously the white and with a petal
let's try the lower speed with a switch and the higher nice it's working <laughs> But definitely it is faster with a power adapter, I can feel it. But I like it because it is portable and you can use it at any time, anywhere and fixing your clothes. My older experience with this sewing machine is very positive. This is my first time that I test that kind of product, I hope I'm doing well. I like using it a lot, it is so easy all the adjustments and the switches to use. And the final results are very good. I like that it has 12 different stitches, gives you the option to choose what is the best for you. And it costs only 90 euros. I think the price is very good. Final conclusion, if you need that kind of product to your home, well for me thumbs up, just buy it. Until my next video my viewers, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, it takes only one second, press the subscribe button and done. Share this video, you never know who may need it and hit the notification bell because more videos in the future are coming and you don't want to miss it. Have a nice and lovely day. Bye-bye.